And then he says, bless all the pure in heart. Now, I don't know, I got a problem with that one. You know, you read that, you say, when Jesus is blessed, could you imagine these, all these people, they listening to him teach, they're astonished. He says, bless all the poor in heart. And, and Jeremiah said, the heart is deceitful and above all desperately wicked. The heart is wicked. So how can the heart be pure? It, does, it doesn't say perfect here because only God is perfect, but it says it's pure. It's the word katharos. We get the word Cather, you know, to be catharized, catharos in the Greek, and, and it means without admixture, you know, or without, you know, what is separated or purged or made clean, it's something because it's unmixed, there's nothing mixed in. Bless all the pure in heart, the person who knows that they're not worthy. That's the pure hearted person. They know, like, I'm not worthy. They know their own spiritual condition and they're mourning over their own spiritual poverty. They don't have anything. Look, the purest thing that any man or woman can do is to admit that they are not pure. That's the purest thing that anybody can do in this room is to admit that you're not pure. And then you'll have a pure heart. You say, What? Yeah. How you doing? Dirty. The Lord working on me. You know, <laughs> I was riding down this morning, and Corey pulled up beside me. He said, man, you better slow down, buddy. I was weaving between cars, you know. <laughs> Woo! And he, I'm eating, you know, cashews. I'm chewing. I said, I'm late. Woo! You know, some good example I am, huh? It says, bless all the pure in heart. Because if you know your own sinfulness and you know your own state, that's what God can meet you at. That's where he can meet you at. Say, Lord, I know I'm, look, I know I'm, I'm, I'm a wretch undone, Lord, help me. I don't want to live like that. Remember when the Lord told Peter to cast his net on the other side of the boat in Luke chapter 5? And the, Peter saw the Lord, he said, depart from me, I'm a sinful man. He knew his condition. He knew his condition. Look, you here today don't look. A pure heart is somebody that recognizes that they're not pure. They say, Lord, work on me. Help me, Lord. And their intentions are good. They can come to the Lord and say, Lord, I'm not, I don't want to live a sinful life. I have a pure, I don't want to live like that. And could you imagine all these people, some of them that was hell of leprosy and all kinds of stuff, standing around hearing Jesus saying these things when the religious leaders say, oh, be like us. Oh, look at the high standards we have. Look at the robes and the phylacteries we have. Look at when we fast, we put, you know, we put all kinds of like powder on our face so people know that we're fasting. Look at us. You've got to live like us. And Jesus said, no, you don't. He said, no, you don't. He says, because this kingdom is different than the world system. 